come back to your great R numeracy class. It sure is wonderful to have you back and you two adults for today's class. You will need the following. One paper plate. Yes, a white one. If you don't have a paper plate in your home at the moment, not a worry. Bring a clean piece of white paper. You can always make a nice big circle for your child. Then a newspaper. A pair of scissors and your color crayons and be sure to not forget your glue. So my class listen up listen up. Have you noticed that there has been a change in the temperature? Have you noticed that it's suddenly colder. What has just happened on the 1st of June in South Africa? Has the season perhaps changed? <laughs> yes, it has. Remember last week and the previous classes we were talking about autumn where the leaves are falling down from the tree branches onto the ground, where the leaves are changing colors from green to yellow, then eventually brown. And now when you look outside, hmm, some trees still have their leaves on, but some are completely without leaves. There's no leaves on. So be sure to look around you and observe the change of season. So I have a question for you. If it was autumn just a week ago, what season are we in in South Africa from the 1st of June. Louder, louder, name the season. Well done. It is winter. So in our classes this week and in the coming weeks, we are going to talk about winter topics. I've got a few surprises up my sleeve for you. But for our mindfulness activity, let's get into the position for that now. Bring your hands up and remember to breathe. In and out. While you watch the clouds moving by, keep this position and thereafter your activity.
now that you have what we need for this activity, a newspaper, a white clean paper plate, or a cut out circle that you've made with the help of the adults from an A4 piece of white paper, your colour crayons, glue and your scissor. You are ready for this activity. So you might be asking Monique, so what are we going to make? Well, my class today, I want you to make a puzzle, a paper plate puzzle. And not just any paper plate puzzle, no, no, no. A number one puzzle. Can you do that? Yes, I'm sure you can. Before we do, let's count from one to seven and backwards from seven to one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and backwards, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Great, my class. Now bring closer dun, 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 your paper plate and an orange color. Do you have an orange crayon next to you? Excellent, bring it closer. If you don't have an orange, you can use another color. But remember to use the same color for this week's middle point of the puzzle. And the patterns that we're going to make. Try that. So now open up your color crayon. I've got my orange color here and I want you to make a dot. Where are we going to make the dot? We are going to make the dot in the middle, Mr. Cyril, in the middle of our paper plate. Then I want you to draw the following pattern. I want you to make a lightning strike like this to the one side. Yeah, adults, give a hand if you see they need some help. Now I want you to make a second line. Let's make a straight line down to the bottom and the side. And now I want you to make a third line. One, two, three. A third line in the shape of a wave. I just pull out my orange colour crayon, just like that. How is yours looking, my class? If you see that the lines aren't very clear, you can go over them again. If they are a bit light, go over them and make them darker. And then the wave, like so.
Then I want you to choose another color. I'm going to use red. And here I want you to ask the adults in the room to write the number name of one down on this piece of the puzzle. So one and make it big in the one area. Then for the number symbol of one, the number symbol of one is one that you can do yourself. I know you will be able to do that. And then take your blue and make one circle on the empty side. The side that is still empty, make one big circle. You want to color it in? Let's do it. Let's color it in. Color, color, color. Color your one circle in. I'm using my blue color crayon. Are you also using blue? That's good. Okay. Now I want you to do the following with your newspaper. I want us to now decorate our number one paper plate puzzle. Make it sparkle. How are we going to do it? Well, I've got an idea. I want you to circle the ones that you can find in your newspaper. Let's do that. Let's find all the number ones. Circle them. Pom, 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 pom. There is a number one. And there is another number one. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there we have two number ones right next to each other. Here is another number one. And here, just next to the swimming pool, and below the swimming pool is a number of them. Look at this beautiful swan and another number one. Now get your faithful pair of scissors. Adults remember a handy tip is when your child is holding the scissor the right way around Perfect. If they are not, mark the top of the scissor with a dot so that they know if they can see the dot or the sticker, then the scissor is correctly placed in their hand and then it will become easier to cut. Now my class, let's cut out all the ones. Come here, one, come here. I'm going to cut you out. Swan, my scissor is coming for you, number one. And another number one. Here are the two number ones that are directly next to each other. We can cut them half 
And now we have two extra number ones. What else can we find? Oh, here we have circled a one. Thank you, Scissor. Pleasure class, pleasure class. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, faithful Scissor. Now you can take your newspaper, fold it, and place it to the side. Because now you have your puzzle. So to make your puzzle pretty, why not give it more color? Let's circle the outside. Let's color the outside of our paper plate puzzle green. Good, class. Do the same. Let's make it green. We will now see the difference between how the number one puzzle look, looks before and after we colored it in with green. Remember just the sides, just the edges of your puzzle. Ha! Oh, I think that looks Beautiful. What do you think, Klaus? Does this look beautiful? Oh, we've, yes, we must still paste our number ones that we found in our newspaper. Thanks for reminding me, children. How do we work with glue? So, for pasting numbers, it is best to put the number down. After opening the glue, of course, Put it down, move your finger over it, pick it up and paste it down. Do that with the other numbers as well. Pick it up, paste it down. And another number one, pick it up, paste it down. And another number one, paste it at the bottom or where you find that there's an empty space. Just like that. Put your glue to the side and now you have made your very own number one paper plate. Oh yes, it's not a puzzle yet, right? We first have to cut it. Scissor, come join the class, Scissor. Oh, I'm so happy to be called back. I thought my, my role in the class was over. <laughs> no, Scissor, you always have to be close by for when we need your help. I'm always happy to help you, class, always happy. Great, Scissor, now you must please cut out on the orange lines. Can you do that? Yes, most definitely I can. Let's start by cutting on this line. And then let's cut on this line. It looks class like you have made a thunder strike. It's almost like you've made lightning. Yes, because we are building a very unique puzzle, scissor. And here it looks like you are swimming in the sea. Yes, scissor, we love swimming in the sea, even if it's a bit cold outside. 
we get the opportunity to visit the sea, we will definitely be in the sea. We can promise you that. Thank you, Scissor, for helping us cut our number one puzzle. Pleasure. Bye-bye, class. Bye-bye. Oh, friendly Scissors. Oh, just love our guests. Huh? Now, come closer, come closer, and look. If you have three pieces of your puzzle, let's count them together. One, two, three. You have just made your very own number one puzzle with three pieces. As we come to the end of today's class, it was wonderful to build your very own number one paper plate puzzle. So for our next lesson, be sure to bring another paper plate and your newspaper, crayons, scissor, glue. And remember, if you don't have a paper plate, let the adults in the house help you to make a big circle, as big as your head, before the class. You will see what we're going to do in tomorrow's lesson. A big thank you to the sponsors and organizations for making our class possible. Now for your homework. I want you, if you haven't made your number one puzzle, I want you to make that puzzle. A number one puzzle with three different pieces. If you have made it, Beautiful, colour it in, make it pretty. Now my class, let's stand up, stand up. Let's sing, dance and count to our special song. Join in.